to Blount. Camilla's in a bad mood today. I'm in a great mood. Lupe is not. Oh, we went to Blount. I freaking love Blount. I told you. So the last time I was here, I came with my friend Joe. I got the their monster or giant lobster roll, huge, and he got the spicy fish sandwich, and he said it was really really good. So we were looking spicy at spicy fish wrap. Fish wrap. So I I was telling Lupe I was like, oh mm. Joe really liked this last time. Maybe you should consider getting it. Good move. It's always tough. Like I don't want to give you credit. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give Joe credit. Joe, great choice, buddy. Mm. Um, we, I also got the fried whole belly clams. Mm. I love whole belly clams. That was juicy. Um, I love fried whole belly clams. I also got a set of fruit. You could get fruit, <coughs> fries, sweet potato fries, or two clam cakes. I'm sure. Are you sick? Oh. And then it's cool that you can do two clam cakes instead of fries. Yeah, some people don't like fries. I like it, but it it's, makes sense for a clam shack place yeah. to do clam dates. It's actually a pretty solid wrap, I'm not gonna lie. I like that they grill it down too. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -hmm. um, mm. The way that I eat my whole bellies is weird, apparently. Some people say it's weird, some people say it's not. I dip it in the tartar and then in the ketchup. Um, There's a little cocktail sauce? Yeah. And, it's well, like cocktail sauce here. It's like cocktail sauce, but without the horseradish, I guess, right? Like, I don't do cocktail sauce. Do you don't like horseradish? It. I don't. I do like horseradish, but for whatever reason, with this, I like the sweetness mm. that comes from ketchup. Weird. I know. You but want it? Really good. Because you're a little sweet. Mm. Compliment. I'm a, sweet, I'm a sweetheart. See what I'm saying? I'm a sweetheart. That's what I am. This may be nice. We are. I like how everyone is just parked next to us, not doing anything. Mm. It's 80. See, this is the perfect day for something like this. I love. What is your perfect date? April 25th. Because it's not too hot, not too cold. That's a valid answer. All you need is a light jacket. Isn't. What, when did the uh, competition recently? Um, yeah, I mean, like a month and a half ago, two months ago? This Rhode Island USA happened? No, 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 the, the oh. national one. Mm -mm. Coming up. Coming up very soon. Really? The girl from Rhode Island, yeah, she's going to compete. Uh, I will be watching. Also, guys, you can't go to a clam shack without getting some chowder. Mm. And New England clam chowder is just superior. Oh no. Why, you like the. the, the no, I like. Was it the Connecticut? Is that what the red one is? Manhattan. Manhattan. What's the white one? Uh, it's the called clear white. one? Yeah, the clear one. That's New England. So this is New England, and then the clear one yeah. is uh, Rhode Island. Oh, is it Rhode Island? Mm -hmm. I made that face because I can't have that kind anymore. Oh my god. So I can only have the Manhattan or the clear chowder. And honestly, the clear chowder is almost, um, what you call it? I thought I took a clam or a belly. I think you ate it already. Did I? Oh, no, I put it in my thing. Mm. The the clear chowder is almost like a, like a soup. Mm -hmm. It's like having chicken broth. Mm. Oh, good bellies. Yeah, good bellies. Very crispy. Um, I do a good job now. Mm -hmm. So one thing that I found out, guys, well, two things. We'll get into the second thing in a minute. So Blount is just a huge soup maker. Mm -hmm. We're very fortunate. They participate in, um, in Taste of Rhode Island. Now, one thing that I didn't know, and this is where you're going to jump in here. Mm -hmm. is, <laughs> I thought you were going to start it off. No. So one of the things is that Blount is actually behind a huge account on social media a lot of the big time clam shit clam shacks and restaurants and places around the country okay. they actually use blount's soups um which i found really interesting so um 
I guess if you were to get it like to go or anything like that, literally they use their, their exact clam chowders, um, the Manhattan chowders, um, and the clear is more native to Rhode Island, so you won't really find that, but it's most of the New England and the Rhode, uh, Manhattan ones that you'll find elsewhere. I do like the clear though. I really like the clear too, because it's one of the main ones I can have that give like a resemblance to what I miss. I mean, it's almost like, I hate to compare it to this, but kind of, it's like clear like a chicken noodle soup kind of. Like it's clear, guys. This is clear broth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's, I actually don't know the base of it. Do you know the base? We should learn how to make it. It's Rhode Island seawater. <laughs> Just straight up salt water? It's the trick to everything. Probably right, is. Let me try your weird concoction here. All right, guys, she it's dips good. it in. Yeah, tartar. Tartar and, and then ketchup. And ketchup. kind of like I find people that eat their eggs with ketchup we were just talking about this really weird my mom eats hers with maple syrup like if she gets bacon I like having my maple syrup with bacon but then she'll pour the maple syrup all on her eggs I think that's weird so here's the thing when I'm at breakfast and I have eggs with like home fries a little bit of ketchup hits it or salsa i love salsa on eggs anyways but like it just look at his little tail it's, it's not a, it's an average size tail okay <laughs> right ladies um it touches my eggs i'm not i'm not spazzing out but no. some people out there they'll get a bottle of ketchup Right on their eggs. Psychopaths. No. Have you ever had their coleslaw? This is uh, the first time having it? No, I've had it at their... They also have like clam oh, shacks. Yeah. Uh, they have two clam shacks in Rhode Island. One in East Providence, one in Warren. Don't forget about their uh, their food truck. Then you can find at so many food festivals and food fairs. But um, I love their coleslaw. It's like a kale coleslaw. It's, very, it's like sweet almost like sesame like i don't know it's very good yeah their own proprietary mm -hmm. situation also their market here too guys you guys can get uh, seafood i saw cohogs on the menu a lot of good stuff it's like a fish market there's like fish that you can get you can get rice dairy farm milks you can get um Ooh, really good wrap oh thank you joe joe you're the man I'm offended. thank you for being just a person that makes good decisions And, and bestowing the knowledge the the energy into the world whereas it wanted wanted me to try it today cheers to joe cheers to joe you can't not cheers joe so cheers joe thanks joe mm. so good all right you ready to go do you have anything to plug what do you got going on she's going to hawaii without me my friend is getting married in Hawaii. Um, they've been engaged for three years. And... Do you want a long engagement? No. The reason why I said it with that authoritative... That is, <laughs> you mean with that little bit of psychoness? Yes. Is because <laughs> my ex and I, um, his mom, was like, why don't you guys just get engaged? And I was like, I don't want a long engagement. And I'm really happy I didn't because then I would have had to break off an engagement. And that is hard. You would have got a ring out of it. I do have a ring on. Would you want to give the ring back? Some women do, some women don't. I have an idea of what you would actually do and what you're actually going to tell the camera. I would give it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was perfect. <clears throat> I do have my promise ring still. What is a promise ring? It can, it can it's a promise anything. to get like married. Like one day we will get married. I guess that promise fell through. For the better. We're, I wish nothing but the best for still you. Still have a long life. Yeah, but not with him, I mean. We don't know what's going to happen. Do we know what's going to happen 10 years from now? I have a rule that I don't go back to exes. Well, Actually, I had a long talk with Nikki yesterday. Only if every rule was never broken. 
I had a long time for Nikki yesterday. And I was like, Lupe said I don't have it in me to do another one. He said, I was like, Lupe obviously wants us to get married and stuff like that. And I was like, I oh, think Lupe's right. I don't this is have a, another. I this don't is have our private credit. conversation? Well, it stemmed from someone saying, I don't have enough energy to do another relationship. And I was like, neither do I. Lupe, Lupe agreed with me that I don't have enough energy to do another relationship. So you're forced with me. Sorry. I'm sorry. Hmm. And what was his rebuttal? I'm like, all right. I was like, I love you. And I was like, yeah, I love you too. The word you tell women just to relax. Come to relax. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, this is really good. Hitting the spot. Mm. Hitting what spot? Oh, the whole alphabet. Guys, only hit one spot. Excuse me? What? No, we have a. We get. I got watermelon. We get heart ons. Get it? Heart ons? Heart ons? Oh, that's so funny. <sighs> Alright, this uh, video is. <gasps> going that way. Um, chowder and oh. watermelon doesn't go together. Oh. Mm. All right, guys, we love you. We're out of here. We're going a little crazy. We love you guys so much. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. Um, we're starting a puppy fun. Camilla might be adopting a dog named Brady. I am named adopting adopting a dog named Brady, and he's a Chewini. I'm really excited. It's a collective adoption. <laughs> Everyone. I have a watermelon. Watermelon's good for you. Please tell me when I. Eat. When did I go to like a big stage and I said, I proclaim to the world that watermelon is not good for you. Do not eat watermelon. You literally just put it in my face and said, it's good for you. <laughs> like, I, I know that. You know where I get that from? Where? My mom. <sighs> let's not, let's not, <laughs> let's not use mom as a power source for things. Let's not take after mom on certain things. Like her desire to force feed people. How's that cola? It's yeah, their it's like, own. It's theirs? It's not theirs, but it's like from another brand and it's made yeah. with real cane sugar. Like they don't use. Yeah, it's called Owl's Alternative or something like that. I don't know. It's like a, 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 I don't know. Do you call this a small batch? I don't know what you call it. Um, I guess so. Because they don't use, like the thing is, is that they don't use like Coca Cola brand. You know what I mean? Yeah. And they also, um, real cool in the market too, guys. They have a bunch of local stuff in there. Like I saw um, some of the kimchi stuff. We saw. Oh yeah. Uh, what else did we see in there? I said the right dairy from the coffee. Oh, yeah. They had coffee milk, strawberry the milk, strawberry. chocolate milk. Their milk. strawberry milk is on point. So good. Um, yeah, you can't go wrong with anything there. They have, they have just some. Oh, and did you Can see Cam their soup? Camille's ready to go, guys. Did you see their soups? I did. They even had Panera soups. Did you see that? I think they make Panera soups. I wouldn't be surprised if. Island didn't make Panera soups. Like helped them? Yeah. You know watermelon is good for you? Did. Did you know? Did you know? I didn't know. I love watermelon. That's my favorite summertime fruit. I like it year round though. But it's not in season. Yeah, but. So it doesn't get like sweet. Mm. You know you're not supposed to have fruits that aren't in season? How does that mess with the ecosystem? No, there's a lot of preservatives and stuff to keep them. Yeah. So if anybody tells you they're allergic to watermelon, <laughs> they are not. It's like people that say that they're allergic to, um, what is that? I hear pineapple a lot. I'm like, no, it's just eating at your tongue. That's the thing. Yeah, it literally eats. There's a there's a protein on that or an enzyme or whatever. There's, that's literally one of the few things in the world that eats a human. Like alive, literally. Yeah, it's a pineapple. This one time I ate so much it made my tongue bleed. <laughs> yeah, same. I did that as a kid. How old were you when you did it? As an adult, maybe. Like a year ago. Yeah. <laughs> Last Tuesday. All right, yeah. guys. We love you. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Do, all, do the damn thing. Do all the things. Um. Okay, let's like, comment, share, share, subscribe. Be well, eat well, take care of each other. We love you guys. And uh, you gotta, you gotta airdrop this to me. 
You got a few to airdrop. You I'm have three to airdrop. I'm not airdropping you nothing. Alright. You know why? You we love you guys. You don't deserve it. I deserve everything. Hold on, guys. Let's see how much Camilla loves me. What? Go to my contact. What? Go to Lupe. Got it. Watch out. Some of our messages. Zero emojis next to my name. Zero, guys. Zero. There was a heart next to it. Oh, what happened to it? I actually don't know. When I transferred contacts out to this phone, it changed everything. I'm not even kidding. That's right. I don't want it. I've, I recently found out that my name has a bunch of emojis on someone else's phone. And that's why I will be spending less time with you as time goes by. Uh-huh. So, just let you know. Lights, comment, share, subscribe. Luka has a few girls that like Don't say that. Too. A few girls? No, no, no. That, that makes like it sound... Him. Hold on. That like him. Hold on. That like him. You don't let me finish. Luka has a few girls that like no. him. And it's really sweet. No. Because like, he's a comment, very genuine person who deserves share, love. Share, subscribe. And Heart be well, and soul, eat well, and to take care of I only of have him, one love in my life. It's me and Brady. And it's going to be the doggy. It's me and Brady. Are you like sad that you're going to get replaced by a dog? No, because I'm going to be over your house every day playing with that dang dog. I feel like you should keep the name. He looks like a Brady. Yeah, it's too close to uh, Brady. Oh, I, can't, I forgot. Yeah, I can't do that. Sorry. It's spelled differently though. It's B-R-A-Y-D. It's a little much. It's a little Man, much. You, yeah. you just love Ed so much you named your dog Brady. That's kind of perfect. It's too It's too close. Dang it. Yeah. So you do you want another name? Carmelo. You're, you're, I was thinking Gemma. No. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.